And welcome back, everyone, to Subnautica. Uh, when I last left off, we were beginning our steady approach towards the Aurora, and I was kind of bummed out because I was unable to find the coffee machine in these wreckages. Thankfully, our map is saving most of the details for us, so it will be a lot easier for us to come back for these at a later time. Thank goodness for that mod I have that allows me to make maps. Uh, or rather, create a detailed map of the area. Really helps when it comes to uh, navigation in this game. You know, because without the map, it's basically entirely using local landmarks to keep your bearings. And personally, I don't think I've played the game enough recently to be able to navigate with only local landmarks. Ah! Actually, that is a useful piece of equipment right there. Me. Scan it. This is a power transmitter. New blueprint acquired. New blueprint acquired. The, uh... Yeah, the power transmitter. It's basically a small device that lets you transmit power from one generating source to another. It's like an energy bridge. I'm not exactly sure how far they go, but they do bridge power, so... You know, when it goes to making a geothermal generator down in the, um... I've said too much. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. In the active volcano zone, it will be much easier to... Ooh, ooh, I should probably get up there and, uh capture that, but I know that there's a leviathan over here, so I'll have to be quick. Integrating new PDA data. New blueprint acquired. Okay, uh, we need to get back over here towards the Aurora. And, uh... Yeah, I'm not actually going to drive my Seamoth over there by the Aurora, and you'll probably figure out why pretty quick once we reach the disembarkation point. Life form readings in this region are sparse. The Aurora's radioactive fallout will have devastating effects on the alien ecosystem if not contained within the next 24 hours. Yeah, that... that roaring sound does not bode well for me. Ow! Damn it! Where the hell do you run, you little? There you are, you little crab bastard! Yeah. Yeah, that clicking sound is it uh, confirming? The target is dead. Yeah. Good bit of fire in need of extinguishing in here.
Yeah, I gotta get those entrances unlocked. So apparently the entire front half of the ship was basically just obliterated in a massive Warning. nuclear... Ship's structural integrity is low. Fire suppression equipment and laser cutters may be required. Exploration is conducted at your own risk. I love this thing. Oh no, look at that, a Karar infected death crab. I don't see the crab, but I hear it. Oh, I didn't realize I could move big shit. Caution. Scans show the digestive tracts of nearby life forms contain human tissues. So many damn death crabs. The worst of them should be over by now, though. Good, fresh water. Those are some stubborn ass fires, I gotta say. Hmm. Yeah, there's no use in trying to extinguish systems are everything. Running on local reserve power. Unable to remotely download black box data. Integrating new PDA data. Yeah, if you don't uh, move these boxes out of the way with this gravity gun, or propulsion cannon as they call it, let's be honest here, it's a gravity gun. We all know it's a gravity gun. We've all seen Half-Life. Oh, right. Yeah. Integrating new PDA data. Prawn suit. Perfect. And a battery. Yep. Integrating new PDA data. Okay, so we got launches.
Thankfully, I believe that's the last we'll probably need. Um, as far as, uh... Ow. The propulsion cannon goes. I believe it's just that that needs to be moved. Oh, fuck. Uh, let me see. Scans of damage to the Aurora do not no. match any known offensive technologies. Well, fuck. Okay, then I guess we gotta go the other way, since I don't know any of the codes to get in through this door. I know that both the entrances connect up to one another and that you can go through either or in order to um, reach the uh, reactor room, but the real uh, issue is I've walked all the way the fuck up here and I gotta walk all the fuck back down. Or I could just do that, yeah. Seems like a much better idea. Good thing we already killed all those fucking crabs. Vital signs stabilizing. Hmm. Integrating new PDA data. Lab access. Yeah, let me take a look at that PDA for lab access. So, data bank. And data downloads, codes and clues. Lab access and notes to self. Ah! This must be at 1454 for the other one. Six four eight three. Okay. Six four eight three is the code to access the lab. There we go. And the door is open by. I'll come back later to get all of this equipment for decoration purposes. Right now, I'm just interested in the bare bones shit. New blueprint acquired. And uh, sealing the corruption was detected on your PDA. Your technology blueprints have been updated. Okay then. Now let's laser cut this door open because I believe it is the only way in. Okay. Yeah, it's the only way further in from here. Another battery. How many batteries did they think we would need? What they really should have prioritized is food and water. You can easily starve to death in this place if you're not careful. Well, if you're not careful and you don't know where you go. Ah, the prawn suit bag. Just what I needed. Let's do one first. Yeah, then we'll do one. 
Yeah, scan this prawn suit fragment. Okay. And this prawn suit fragment. Picking up a faint black box signature originating on the other side of the hull breach in this room. Come on, let me, uh, let me... Somewhere right there, it doesn't. Okay. Okay, so, now we just got to worry about getting up these here steps, which is no problem. You don't even have to use the whole, actually, you know what, we've been going just long enough. I'll cut it here, and I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.